past the ammunition. The focus is the family scenes, and that's where the heart of the show is. Here he is. Leonard said we should have a dinner scene. We didn't expect it to become such a regular, you know, feature of every show. Ever since the pilot, that family scene is the viewer's favorite scene. Your mom's riding around on the Ios again, huh? Don't make this about me. I'm not the one that slapped some guy around and stuck his head in the toilet. What do you know about it? Dad stuck somebody's head in the toilet? When we had shown CBS the script, the family scene was nine pages long. And they said, well, you can't have a nine page scene. And we said, well, that's what it is. I guess we could cut it down later. The thing that captivated us, I think, was the idea that you were free to express different views at the dinner table and that that was tolerated and encouraged. If you're allowed to twist force and torture, then you corrupt the moral fiber of the culture. Nobody's in favor of torture. The issue is the use of enhanced interrogation. Is it ever justified? I say no. The dinner table is such a, I think, wonderful centerpiece for the show. The dinner scenes are always that moment in the episode where you get to A, see the whole family together, and B, you get a little bit more flavor of probably what's going on, whether with the case or the secondary story, and see people's personal views on it, which kind of makes it different than most cop shows.